we're getting down to the wire. It's four days before we go to Peru. The American Society for Microbiology will be leading a workshop as part of the International Initiative Women in Science STEAM Camp. Uh, the goal of the camp is to inspire girls interested in the STEAM fields, science, technology, engineering, art, design, and mathematics. And we hope to meet the girls' expectations. When we get down to Peru, I'll be rendezvousing with my colleague, Paolo Scavone, who will be helping us to co-lead this activity. We'll be teaching the girls how to build microscopes. WISI stands for Women in Science, so it's an initiative to provide an environment for girls, girls especially from the APEC countries with an opportunity to study with some of the brightest women like them that have excelled in these different careers and learn from them uh, in a more intimate environment. Primarily because girls in general and especially in developing countries are not encouraged in these different subjects um, the way that, that men have been. Today we are going to construct some microscopes mm -hmm. to use with our cell phones okay. so they can take it home and, and keep using it. Perfect. And also we are going to plate their bacteria of their bodies in petri dishes. Okay. So that's the idea of the first workshop of the ASM. Abran sus bolsitas. Agarren esos clavos bien grandes. Ahora, la tuerca esa lo que va a hacer es fijar el perno a la madera. En varias escuelas no hay microscopios. Puse la, el primer objeto debajo del microscopio y lo pude ver. Fue la mejor parte porque se veía realmente increíble y nunca antes lo podía haber visto así. Nunca antes había tenido la oportunidad de hacerlo. Fue demasiado bueno. Esto es lo que tenemos que lograr todos. ¿Sí? I enjoyed the microbiology class. It was tricky at first, and we have to assemble the microscope by ourselves. And I was going outside looking for like grass to practice on my microscope. And that was a really beautiful part because it was a thing that we can do at home and take it to my school. Ahora bien, ¿de dónde vamos a cultivar bacterias? En la piel, en la boca. Huele mal. Huele mal. <laughs> ¿Dónde más? Todo lo que tocamos. ¿Cómo vamos a hacer para cultivar entonces algunas bacterias de nuestro organismo? Les vamos a entregar un cotonete a cada uno de ustedes. ¿sí? Con este cotonete van a tomar la muestra y la van a sembrar en esta placa. Hola, buenos días. Bueno, segundo día de clases en la cual vamos a hacer un diseño experimental con eh, microorganismos, en particular con levaduras. A lot of what the girls have been talking about in their small groups is that if they don't see something, they can't aspire to it. So having women like Dr. Paula Savone and Isabel Montoya here in person and other partners, including the American Society for Microbiology on the camp, and each partner is bringing something unique to the table, really serving as role models for the girls is really inspiring for them to see that they themselves can achieve that. Then I think that once they go home, they'll be better um, suited to explain to their parents, even to their classmates, their teachers, what they want to achieve and just engage. I think part of this camp is really encouraging them to just be part of the discussion, that they have a role in this. They're not just bystanders, but they can actively create their own world. O sea, lo que he ido aprendiendo acá, siempre me gusta transmitirlo a otras personas. Eh, porque no me gusta que el conocimiento se quede en una persona, sino que lo tiene que pasar hacia otros. Son libres de irse, muchas gracias. Nosotros nos vamos a ir mañana, así que gracias a todos. We're now back from Peru at ASM headquarters. 
In working with the U.S. Department of State and the Asia Pacific Economic Cooperation, ASM was able to provide 100 girls with microscopes and the knowledge on how to use them. The women leaders at the camp nurtured the girls' passion for scientific discovery, and the girls were excited to share their experiences with friends and families across Latin America. To learn more about ASM's international outreach, please check out asm.org international. I'm very excited because it's my first microscope. <laughs>